Hello, everybody. It is 9.54, February 1st. First day of the new month, second month. Time flies, don't it? I don't think we have much time, you guys, and, and I think you guys already know that. There's nothing I'm telling you that you don't already know. Um, yesterday, when I found that, I'm going to provide in the um, description box. Please check it out. Um, this is one of those bands, those one-hit wonders, you know, and they're not even from this country. They're from, like, Europe someplace, but uh, I something came over me today, and I started, because that red balloon that we found at the front door yesterday, I kept thinking, you know, something about that red balloon, man. It just kept on, you know, getting to me a little bit, and uh, so I checked out The Matrix to uh, see that movie about what they're talking about, the red pill and the blue pill, you know, those that are going to be awake. And then, uh, for some reason, this thing, the lightness and the darkness doesn't seem to be working too good. Let me hold it up a little bit taller. But anyhow, um, then this morning, I started thinking, you know, like, because I've been going out, you know, trying to find anybody I could find to wake him up for several years and um, the, the 99 and that I started thinking about that because I've been seeing 99 everywhere 999 999 or 99 and then that song 99 red balloons and I'm going huh I, I wonder what that song's about um, you know 99 red balloon because I never really listened to it in detail and when I found the song and I'm going to provide it in the description box you'll hear where it'll even show like you know where they they're popping the balloons but you'll see like explosions like war that's coming and that's what she's singing about war coming and uh and I believe that's what's gonna be getting ready to happen Somebody even uh, showed like that train wreck the other day. Um, remember I was on the train coming here and I was like, hmm, I don't see any signs in my ticket showing anything, you know? Well, somebody was hit on that train crossing the tracks, walking on the tracks. I don't know. But um, I was like, man, I hope that wasn't a demonic spirit that caused some poor soul to get killed on these trains and uh anyhow um come to find out i'm like wow i might have to wait till tomorrow to catch another train and cynthia's like well you know you can get a room for the night and stretch out there and i thought you know well you know what i'll just sit in the station and wait if i have to i said i just i can't see wasted money like that you know in a hotel room but anyhow um I get to the train station, they say there's one leaving in four hours, 10-10, ten, ten. you know, exactly, 10-10, ten, ten. you know, seeing the doubles again, 10-10, ten, ten, like, you know, the completion number. And then they said, 10-10, ten, ten, train number 66. I'm like, wow, 66. And that's exactly how many chapters there are in the King James Bible, 66 chapters. And then 1010 is a completion number. It's a mirror of a completion number. Um, but anyhow, um, then a few days later, I, I'm on an Amtrak when this happened. And then a few days later, the House of Congress is on a train on an Amtrak. And they charted, I guess, this whole train. And uh, Minnie Fish did a video on it. And I'm going to tell you, you'll find... I'm going to load that up for you, too, by Benny Fish. I'll have that in the description box. Where uh, he said the place that they were going to was a very wealthy, prestigious place. And what I found very interesting was this place had a bunker in it where they were heading to. Um, you know, and then the red balloon, you know, and the song talks about war. Um, I'm seeing 99 everywhere. You know, these people could be getting themselves in position where there's a bunker. They're going to talk and discuss things, but they're going where there's a bunker. They say, many fish, you got to listen to it. He said, 
they say that it's three stories below ground, three stories. He said, if they say it's three, it's probably nine. If they say it's a half a mile wide, it's probably a mile wide. You know, in other words, you can't believe what they say, but we know there's a bunker there where they went, where they were going, and they're probably there now. Um, the crossroad, you know, it happened right at a crossroad, and the trash truck was right between the two arms. I mean, he, he could have easily drove off, you know. I mean, I, I would get off of those tracks before, but this is spiritual, you guys. That's why it says we wrestle not with flesh and blood. That's why we're seeing the signs everywhere with what's going on. So if you get a chance, please check the description box. You're going to love the video by uh, Mini Fish because his description of everything, how it's, you know, the, I mean, he, he did his research. You're going to like watching that. Um, but also watch this song and see what it's about the 99 balloons, 99 red balloons. It speaks about war. And then this House of Congress going to, oh, not only that, when I looked up that song, uh, 99 Red Balloons, the thumbs up, four, four, four. You know, exactly. Then yesterday, I went, something told me to look up Solomon's Wisdom, King Solomon's Wisdom with Yule Brenner. And I did, and it was 777 thumbs up. You know, this is just the Lord revealing things. Here in 1 Corinthians, uh, 1 Paul, chapter, or 1st chapter, verse 27. God has chosen the foolish things of the world to confound the wise. And God has chosen the weak things of the world to confound the things which are mighty. And base things of the world and things which are despised has God chosen, yeah, and things which are not, to bring to naught things that are, that no flesh should glory in his presence, but of him ye in Christ Jesus, who of God has made unto us wisdom and righteousness, sanctification and redemption, that according as it is written, that he gloreth, let him glory in the Lord. We need to be praising our Lord in all things. You know, I mean, this is powerful, you guys. I'm going to do a little Bible study on this here in a little while, a live video. Um, here at um, verse 25 and 26. Because the foolishness of God is wiser than men, and the weakness of God is stronger than men. For you see your calling, brethren, now that not many wise men after the flesh, not many mighty, not many noble are called. Wow. Awesome. It's awesome, you guys. And last night I had a dream where as I was leaving, you know, it's like I, cause I'm, I'm feeling tired, wore out, been doing this forever, it seems like. As I was walking away, you know, I kicked one of those little orange cones that they put in the store, like if it's a wet floor or something around it, I kicked it. Then a voice behind me said, Mark, the Lord is coming. And uh, and I said, Amen. You know, Amen. We just have to stay strong, you guys. I know I've been feeling like, <laughs> you know, it's like, come Lord, you know, we're tired. But the signs are there, you guys. Please check out the description box. I'll have the mini fish in there, the video that I told you where he did that. Um, there's a lot of people doing videos on that right now and uh, what they're coming up with and what they're seeing. Um, I really liked the research that mini fish did on it, and uh, Jonathan Kleck also did some. Um, but like I said, I like the research that mini fish came up with. And Jonathan Click also has some things on there. And then listen to the lyrics on the 99 Red Balloons. And then we found a red balloon right here at the front door. Um, these are all signs from the Lord. And then there is 444 thumbs up when I looked up that song this morning. Um, I was the 444th. It was 443 when I looked at it and I went, I liked what I was seeing, so it made it 444. 
But anyhow, um, God bless you guys. I love each and every one of you. Please check the description box. In Jesus' name.